Hi everyone, Orkan here from Nextcell, and in this short video, we'll learn how to create welcome discount pop-up for your online shop. As soon as you log into the dashboard, click to the button Add New Campaign. Here we have three categories of tools, notifications, pop-ups, and bars. So we'll pick the pop-up one. You'll be taken to the pop-up builder. In the right-hand side, we see the preview section, and on the left-hand side, you can simply fill out the message section, add a countdown timer, customize the colors, fill up the, the image, and more. So let, let's just uh, pick up the image. We can use the URL or just upload the custom image, upload from the, from the desktop, or just pick some stock photos. So let's pick this one. Yeah, cool. And below we can change the position of that image. We can make it right or left. Yeah, beside of that, we can also enable the other uh, input fields, like uh, we can collect a full name or just uh, phone numbers as well. And down below we see the colors, that everything is uh, customizable here. Also, we can enable the uh, close button that is uh, on the corner and enable the close as a text button that is in the below. So we can change that and say like, no, thanks, kind of this stuff. Yeah, as soon as we finish with that part, we have to go to success uh, part of the message. And here we can edit the text or add the discount coupon code, for example, here. This will be the discount code, and the visitors will click on that, and this code will automatically copy to the clipboard. As soon as we finish with design part, we have to click to the next button to go and set up when to trigger this pop-up. So we can name this pop-up like a welcome discount pop-up, and click to the change the rules. Here you can enable your campaign on desktop or mobile or just in both of them. Adjust the frequency, let's say one time within a one day. On the triggers, you can make it on exit or just uh, remove the on exit function, enable on scroll, for example, the while 45% scroll, and time based, let's say after the 12 seconds, uh, for the idle timeout, if there's inactivity in the page, let's say for three seconds or four seconds, and for some JavaScript triggers. In the conditions, you can target your, your audience based on the country, based on some specific pages, or authentication stage, like logged in users, uh, or visitor sessions, like first time visitors or returning visitors or for some uh, specific languages uh, in the browser and for target some specific network IP. That's it basically. If you finish your setting up, you just need to click uh, publish button and your campaign will be published straight away and you will see the success message on the top. Thanks for watching.